Hello. In this video, we are going to see a couple of powerful tools for converting your AML file to a HTML format to have a better view of the same so that you can understand more about the parameters, the response codes, the requests, um, etc. from the AML file uh, API documentation. So, um, what we need to do as step one is uh, open your Visual Studio's code and go to the extensions and here either you can type redoc viewer right and I have already installed it I'm not going to install it again so if you do not have it installed yet you will see this kind of a button which you can press and install it or you can choose to install swagger viewer as well so i have already installed it so i'm not installing it again after installing this you can go back to your document and then what you have to do is say control shift p uh, I'll repeat it again, say control shift P, right? And then you can type either Redoc Viewer or Swagger, Preview Swagger. So I select this and if you look at the HTML now, which is generated from this yaml file you can see all the get post delete whatever is there uh, in the yaml document api documentation you can see them all here you can click each of them to look at the parameters that you need to pass the response that you can expect uh, and in some API documentations, you can even document the examples, the schemas, so everything you can view it here. So this is about Swagger preview. preview. Um, the other one, as I said, is Redoc Viewer. So do a similar kind of thing like Control Shift P and uh, type Redoc Viewer. And this is little different it opens up in in browser uh, and then you see you know similar kind of html page with all the details in this right so this will help you understand the api documentation better um, so that you know you can code accordingly so in case um, you are designing your integration uh, with another application and they pass on the api documentation in aml format you can do this step to understand the api better and make a call to the parent application using this api details right so this is it for this video Thank you for watching.